Thursday, last Thursday night? I thought we got better as the game went. You know, early in the game, uh, I think the speed of it was bothering us. So I think as the game went and we settled down, we got more pressure. So toward the end of the game, I felt good about it. Well, what do you think four sacks in the first game does for the morale of the unit that had 14 up last year? You know, again, a lot of this unit wasn't even here last year, so it's probably not being anything to a lot of them. But some of the guys that was here, you know, it's, it's confident for them to know that we can get to the quarterback and we didn't last year. So I'm sure that for the guys that played last year, it, it feels good. Three of those four sacks were from guys who did play last year, so I guess it was some vindication for them a little bit. Yeah, 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 but I think it, it, it takes all four. And, and you know, I, I think you, know, you look at the last sack that Kelsey got, uh, Quay did a great job rushing off the edge, make the quarterback step up, and that's when he, he made the sack. So I think, you know, all four of them working together has helped. And, uh, you know, Dante's sack inside was came from pressure outside. So, you know, I think those guys all work together, and that's what we got to do. And uh, keep the quarterback in the well is just the goal, especially when you got an athletic quarterback like the one North Carolina had. Are you surprised to see that kind of effort out of Kelsey? On Thursday night? No, again, you know, we, uh, Coach Adams did a great job of, of uh, grinding the D line during practice, and, you know, we want effort, and guys know we got to run their football, so, you know, they're not going to play if they're not going to give effort, so we expect that. Has he gotten better in any specific area over last year? Well, I think they all have. You know, I think they all are, are technique and fundamentally better. And, uh, you know, again, uh, the new system, uh, not doing as much as we, we did in the past, that's, that helps. Did Chris Lamont practice today, Whammy? No, no. I think Chris is, uh, is probably uh, doubtful for this game. Due to the injury? Due to the ribs? Yeah, due to the ribs. You rotated like 12 guys in the defensive front uh, in the first game. Was that just a matter of a first game on a hot night, or is that something you guys think y'all are going to do with regularity? No, I think we'll do it with regularity. If we got guys that show us we can play in practice, then you're probably going to see even more players. week. Do you have Dante or Taylor starting this week? Taylor will start. And who starts for Chris if he can play? Uh, I think it's going to be uh, Al and uh, Rico will be the start from what I understand. How much has Kentucky changed or how similar are they this year in terms of their offensive scheme compared to last year? They're kind of similar, but you know I think they're, they're doing more what uh, the coordinator did at West Virginia. So you, know, you can see uh, from the plays that we, we looked at West Virginia, uh, the games they played last season and, and the stuff that they're doing this year are very, very similar. Will Chaz Elder play this week? Uh, you know, Coach Hoke and Coach uh, Brown has to answer that question. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank you, Amy.